What's going on, gang? It's D, your friendly neighborhood tattoo VO, back with another video this week. Let's talk about some things in your budget that can help at tax time. It's time to ink positive. Tips and insight from the tattoo VO, D. Alvis, to help you grow your business each and every week. You're a voice talent, either full time or part time. Either way, you need to keep the books very meticulous because taxes can be tricky, especially when you're running your own business. Now, one of the things I always recommend is keep track of a budget, whether you do it the old fashioned way or you do it through something like QuickBooks. I have a service through them, um, which also brings me to a lot of my monthly expenditures that sometimes we don't think about. You know, I have the Adobe Creative Cloud package to help me with my social media stuff and do my uh, editing and recording through uh, Adobe Audition, which is my preferred DAW. Um, I also have the Source Connect service, which I pay monthly rather than annually. I know, I know, I know. If I paid annually, I'd actually pay less each year, but I like having the monthly because it also helps me with the budgeting for my business and not just for my business, but also that helps with my whole family life too and personal life. So um, keep track of all the things you pay for. Are you using pay to plays? If you're using pay to plays, guess what? You can write that stuff off too. Just keep track of, you know, how much you're spending each year on that. Uh, your coaching, any equipment you buy, um, even your studio space. You can also use your, your uh, electric bills, sometimes depending certain other utility bills. Your phone bill. Do you do business on your phone? Good. Write that shit off. If you have steady clients, make sure you're filling out those W-9s so you can get the 1099s each year. Um, just so many things to do. I also recommend going to an accountant, at least after your first year of doing this, going and seeking an accountant, paying that extra money to go through this stuff, because they will guide you through what your state laws allow, and of course explain all the federal stuff too, because things vary from state to state. One of the beautiful things about living in sunny Florida is I don't have to worry about state taxes. Yeah, just the feds. So, one of the many reasons I chose Florida. Anywho, that's just a quick reminder as we're getting closer and closer to the deadline to file your taxes about six weeks away. Just thought I'd share that with you. And I wish you all the best of luck this week. I'll talk to you again later this week. And as always, keep shining.